Okay, this is going to be a look at VC53, the vintage collection Bon Vindum, who's described as a cantina patron. I think this is the first time they ever did this figure. It came out in 2011. I did buy it back then, but I, and I thought I'd had video. I must have at least photographs of it on YouTube, but I never reviewed it. So I thought today I might as well have a quick look at it on card, obviously. So very nice looking figure. I mean, Stitch and Figures had a, quite a few of these up of late, quite cheap. So I paid £20 for this shipped, which I think is a great price. It's in pretty good condition. It's just got the Darth Maul offer there, which my one that I bought in 2011 also has. But, you know, I thought, why not get another one while they're still quite affordable? This one's unpunched. It arrived, I think it was yesterday, so I've done an unboxing video. So it's quite a nice looking piece and we'll have a good look at it in a minute. So look at the back of the card, VC53. I mean, there he looks very Ray Harrahausen designed, inspired, you know, like a um, sort of Cyclops from something like uh, Sinbad and the Eye of the Tiger, or um, Jason and the Argonauts. It's got that look to it. Very much like a Cyclops. Obviously he's got two eyes though, but you know with the horn. Other figures you could get. So Gamerian Guard, brilliant figure that one. Han Bespin, he's been reissued. Barisofi, she's coming out again on that Clone Wars type card. You've got the Rebel. Fleet Trooper, he's been reissued on the new card in the um, Tentive 4 environment. And then there's uh, Low Grey. He hasn't been reissued yet. <laughs> but probably will get a reissue down the line. VC53. Very nice. So I'm glad I picked it up. And I'm glad it arrived safely because... You know, it's a nice, very attractive looking card and figure. Star Wars logo with the uh, two Luke and Leia there, the offer there. Unfortunately, it goes over some of the image. Then you've got the figure there. It comes with a blue, a cup of blue liquid, a pistol and a a rifle slung over his shoulder. It's quite a nicely sculpted figure as well. I'll, I'll show you that in a minute closer up. The figure's a great sculpt. See the detailing in the face on the costume, all those studs on the leather jerkin just look amazing. The sleeves, the hands, looks like he's wearing gloves, a pistol, the sort of almost bronze coloured pants into the boots brilliant looking figure just with that rifle there with a scope on it quite a nice looking design obviously it has a sling as well this is a great looking figure very nice there's the pistol he comes with working holster great design I mean, back in the day in 2011 12, this was a bit of a peg warmer. Hence, you can still buy this one at a decent price. But I did see this one a lot. But what a great sculpt, head sculpt. Beautiful looking figure. Looks amazing. Definitely looks like something Harry Housen could have designed and animated. Really love the studs in the jacket, waistcoat. Very nice. And it sort of has that look where the jacket looks leathery and the studs look metallic. Brilliant figure. In the Darth Maul life size statue signed by George Lucas. Great image used on that card. I'm 
punched in terms of issues I say this corner is a bit soft there but overall it's in great condition not bad for 20 pounds maybe star action figures will have some more down the line Blurb there. You can tell it's an older figure because of this, the way it's set out on the back. Proof of purchase, Bond Vinden. That Baris Offrey is going to start rising in price, I think. Gamerian Guards, one of the best. Such a brilliant figure. Very nice piece, glad I picked, pulled the trigger. Looks amazing. We were in Hasbro want to knock out a figure that, you know, knock it out of the ballpark as those across the ponds would say, you know, they've done such a good job here. Very nice figure. So this is one, if you collect the vintage collection, definitely worth tracking down now because it probably get reissued though. But you never know. And it's still, you can still find this one at a good price. I mean, look at that face, just amazing. It really looks like that image there. They've done such a good job with this one. Obviously, he's a bit, slightly shorter than probably about five foot five, rather than you know six foot. Yeah. Very nice figure. Okay, so I hope you like watching this video and uh, listening to me waffle on and all that sort of stuff, and you know, definitely. Ray, Har Ray Harryhausen in look, brilliant figure. So definitely one worth tracking down if you can find him. Very nice figure. Comes with a cup as well, full of blue, look at the blue, blue milk. Very nice, it's got the offer there. Great piece. Okay, so cheers, goodbye, bye.